Hey everybody, Sponge Murphy here, back again with the latest Warhammer news. If you guys like these videos, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't. So today's news is GW has acknowledged the Sisters of Battle shortage, but first, is the old world returning? Yes, in a piece of Warhammer news that I thought I'd never be talking about again, but it seems that the old world of Warhammer Fantasy is returning in some shape or form. Now cast your mind back to about four years ago, nearly five at this point, Archeon had came to the Warhammer town, fucked everything up, Sigmar came back, fucked Archeon up, and then the big battle in the middle fucked up the whole Warhammer fantasy world. And everything was gone, people were pissed, I was annoyed, but it reintroduced, well not reintroduced, but it introduced Age of Sigmar into the Warhammer world. In a post on the Warhammer community site, they have announced that they have a dedicated team now working on bringing the old world back. Now it doesn't say what they're working on exactly, but it does compare this to Warhammer 40k's Horus Heresy. They also say that this project is a long way off, like 3 years off, so I'm not going to be expecting any big news anytime soon. So what does this mean? Are the old world rules coming back in some shape or form? Could it be some special box sets like some of the Horus Heresy has? It mentions very very slightly about recreating previous armies, but in reality we don't know what this is going to be turned out to be. My thoughts personally is that it most likely could be a side game like Blood Bowl, Necromunda and, War and what Warhammer 30k kind of has. But is this the right move? This sounds great, like wow the old world is coming back, hooray! But think back just before Age of Sigmar had been introduced. Warhammer Fantasy was stale, updates were sporadic, the rank and file setup was losing its appeal, and the bottom line is it was completely being outsold by 40k. Rumours were that the Space Marines alone were outselling the whole fantasy range at this point. Age of Sigmar was the injection of adrenaline that fantasy needed. The fantasy game is in such a good place right now, why do we need to go back to the old world? Now I love the old world and I, under I really do understand why so many people got pissed off when it just disappeared and I got a little bit pissed off but I can't see this new fantasy project getting to the level of Age of Sigmar. That's why I think this is going to be a specialty game like Blood Bowl and Necromunda. But the thing that does counter this is that the project is so far off it could be anything so it's kind of just speculation for now and that's all we can do is just speculate let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this the big thing the big talking point that came out of this was in its promotional pictures i'm not sure if it was in a video but it says uh, everything comes back around or full circle or something like that and i showed a picture of an old square base personally i don't want to see square bases anymore the rank and file thing was good it was fine but it lo each model wasn't individual with age of sigmar each model part of a unit uh, can stick out in some shape or form and it, you can struggle to do that with the big block of like 40 models in one go models just get lost so much in them big blocks so i like the kind of loose formation that you can have with age of sigmar please do not bring back the square bases i don't miss them i'm sure a lot of people don't miss them but Let's just speculate for now. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think this is going to be all about. It's an exciting time to think about this. I love the the old world lore. I think that's two things that pissed everyone off was the old world lore was completely gone um, and we restarted. And the other thing was Age of Sigmar got off to a slow start. Everyone had their armies and they didn't know what to do with them yet. They didn't, there was no kind of battle tomes or army books for him yet. Uh, it took Age of Sigmar a while to grow into what it was now and it's in such a good place right now. Age of Sigmar is so good now. I'm kind of a bit hesitant to see what they're going to do with this old world. But let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. So, did you get the new Sisters of Battle box? Of course you didn't. The bloody thing sold out in minutes and crashed the website for a while and pissed a lot of people off. Very few people were able to get their hands on these because it's all out so quick. Completely underestimated the amount of units that this is going to sell for Games Workshop. And oh, PS to the people who did get boxes and they're selling them out on eBay for like three times the price. Fuck you, do not buy from these people. I think it was this morning I seen an update on this that they are actually lowering the price on their eBay listings for this because no one is buying off them. Good for you for the people who didn't buy off them. I love using eBay, you can get stuff on cheap, like secondhand stuff, uh, but this is just 
awful fuck you let us try and get it the normal way uh, so please don't buy from people like that the good news is that gw has acknowledged that they have completely underestimated how quickly they would sell out and they're now working on a fix so they've announced that there's a new part of the factory getting built or it's getting finished up now so all these will be getting re-released sometimes in the near future and that's the bad news these fixes won't happen until early 2020 so my ideal date will be probably february because once you kind of get the christmas rush over get your january stuff set up then they'll start putting extra stuff out so maybe you might see this box get re-released in february unless they do a really quick job and get it out before that um but we are getting more uh, sisters of battle stuff coming out pretty soon to have shown on the warhammer community site more sisters of battle models coming out pretty soon which look really nice the sisters i can see why these sold out so quick the sisters of battle had like like an almost cult following everyone wanted them to come out for a while it was like they become myth were they ever going to come back out and now they're here and poof they're gone everyone was wanting them so good news is the boxes come well it doesn't say specifically but it hints kind of at it that the box is going to be re-released and uh, the bad news is we're going to have to wait a couple of months but since we had such a long wait for sisters of, sisters of battle from a couple of, for a couple of years uh, it's a good thing that we don't have to wait too much uh, we don't have to wait as long as that again so that is it for this week's warhammer news let me know what you guys think in the comment section below what are your thoughts on the warhammer fantasy comeback the only thing they have created is the logo and that's it so speculation is going to be wild for this for a couple of months and it is kind of fun to see something like this uh getting so much speculation and so much buzz about it so if you got your hands on the sisters of battle box make sure to let me know in the comment section below let me know what the box is like although i think it's still not out yet by the time this video comes out and he's, i think you still have to wait another week unless you got an early release box that i wish i could get but anyway thanks for watching hopefully you guys like this video make sure to hit the like button subscribe if you haven't and once again thanks for watching and i'll see you guys next video